So as a marketing consultant, a lot of people ask me, what content should I share? And all I reply is test, test, test. Try different things. Test what content gets you likes, what gets you shares, what gets you comments. So for some brands, more like fashion, jewelry, it may be celeb images or celeb news. But for other brands, it may be funny news or a viral video post. So just constantly test and see which post gets the most engagement organically. Then just do a nice mix of that for future posting. So for me, I really like memes, quotes, and e-cards. They're just great for viral sharing. Remember, funny equals shareable. Now one little tip when you share content on Facebook, Tumblr, etc. Include a link to your website in every post you make. Think of it, if someone shares your meme and your link is in the description, when that gets shared 20 times, that description's still below. And my content is linked to that original image. I personally like to brand all my memes and quotes, so I'll put my domain right in the bottom corner. So more on what to post. Obviously, keep it short. How many people in this day and age are just constantly on the run, on the run? Not much time, right? So remember these few rules. I like to post 80 characters or less. From the data I've collected, I get 23% higher interaction than my longer posts. Next, use photos. Posts that include photos receive 39% higher interaction rates. Finally, our call to actions. This is some data I've collected over the past few years, and I've really been astonished by it. So for the first one, when fans are asked to like a post, there's a three times higher rate they will like it. Next, if fans are asked to comment on a post, they are 3.3 times higher likely to comment on that post. And finally, when fans are asked to share a post, they are seven times more likely to share these posts. So you might question, what do I mean by this? Literally, I type this in at the beginning of the post. So I'll say something like, share this photo if you're ready for the weekend too. And it'll be a meme about how Fridays are awesome. This is just a psychological subconscious thing, but I'm telling them, I'm commanding them to like this, to comment on this, share this. So some more posting rules that I follow. The 70-20-10 rule. This is pretty common in marketing classes, so you may recognize this. 70% of content should add value and build brand recognition. So example, you posting your own memes, your quotes, different viral shares, relevant articles. You're shaping your brand 70% of the time with posts you make on social media. Next, 20% should be sharing other people's ideas, articles, content, YouTube videos, Facebook posts, retweets. But make sure to share things that are relevant to your brand. Other people create awesome stuff, right? So obviously, use it 20% of the time. Finally, a lot of people flip this. They're promoting 100% of the time. You're going to scare your fans away. You're going to get people to unfollow you. Only do promotional posts 10% of the time. So do coupons, discount codes, new item on sale, etc. Only 10% of the time. So for every 10 posts, you can only do one. Two golden rules of content I love. Commit to posting as much as possible. Once you start to follow some of these Facebook pages on your Facebook Insights, you'll see some of these million-like pages posting 650, 1,000 times a week. It may seem overkill, but you're hitting your entire market throughout the day with different varying types of marketing materials. But remember, be mindful to not overdo it. Some of these brands do. So too many tweets or status updates can cause your follower to hide or unfollow you. Next, engage with your followers. It's all too easy to just push content to your people constantly, right? But engage with your community. When people comment on something, like it. When people ask a question, reply quickly. Build a rapport with your audience, and they're definitely going to share it with their friends. Oh, hey, this guy instantly answers me on his Facebook page. Really cool guy. Loved his products. By engaging your followers, your return is going to be tenfold.